This video will cover the creation and modification of B-splines. Sketching 2D figures is the first step in creating 3D geometry. When sketching, make sure you have status hints turned on so Libre can tell you what it's looking for as you proceed through the sketching process. The B-spline tools are located here in the Sketch Figures box on the 2D sketching ribbon. Here you'll find the Spline by Control points, which uses the last two mouse clicks to generate the third point, and also the Spline by Interpolation points, where each mouse click will be a peak or a trough. These two B-splines were created using the same grid intersection points. These items allow you to edit the B-spline. Move control points. That will modify the shape by moving a control point. Move curve points, which can modify the shape by moving a location on the B-spline curve to a new position. Insert knots. Insert new knots on the curve knot vector without changing curve shape. Remove redundant knots. Remove existing knots that can be removed without changing the curve shape. Libre Design will automatically remove any possible knots, then a dialog box will appear letting you know about the results. In this case, there are no redundant, unused knots because every knot is helping to define the shape of the spline. In this video, you learned about the basic differences between B splines created with control points and interpolation points. You also learned how to modify these splines with the commands available in the spline drop-down menu.